You are the only person I have, and I can't get you on the phone. What am I supposed to do? You have Melissa. Melissa is paid to be there to help you. Melissa ain't family. I'm talking about my kids. I should be able to talk to you when I feel like I need to talk to you. I don't know if my breathing is worsening, and these doctors are saying everything is fine. I know it's not fine. I muted my phone, took a deep breath and rolled my eyes. My mother was on one of her mental health rants. I could tell she hadn't taken her medicine or her dosage needed to be adjusted. After unmuting, I said, the last time you were at the doctor, he said your lungs sounded fine. I don't care what he said. I know my body. I know when I'm not feeling like they're working right. Have you been smoking? What the, what do you, her stuttering was a clear sign she was formulating a lie. What does smoking have to do with it, but also no? Have you been taking your medicine? Why every time I call you concerned about not spending enough time with my daughter, you automatically talk about some medicine? Medicine don't cure everything. I'm not the smartest person, but I know what I feel right now is real. Mom, can you take a breath and think about the question I just asked? If you're having these feelings of panic and taking your medicine, the doctor needs to know the medicine isn't working. I'm not dismissing how you feel. Yes, you are. You do that all the time. Do I? Well, maybe you don't. The medicine makes me feel weird. Scrolling through the Uber Eats app, I hoped the conversation would wrap up soon. I was starving. And then when I told the doctor the medicine made me feel funny, he ignored me and gave me more. He didn't ignore you. He listened, took notes, and adjusted your dosage. Well, it felt like he wasn't listening. Okay, Mom, I have to go. I have a dinner date. A date? With Jimmy? Jimmy and I aren't together anymore. I tell you that every time you mention him. Oh, that's right. You don't think you could have made it work with Jimmy? I will talk to you later. Have a good evening, I responded, ignoring her question. Okay, enjoy your date. I will. I disconnected the call, rested my head on the back of the couch, and massaged my temples. Conversations with my mother always drained me.